Ooh, happy Friday. some Friday pizza it's fresh it's a place where like you're supposed to just get like the slices that are there but they insisted they made me make it for me fresh oh my goodness oh my gosh Peter it's finally getting my dream I'm finally getting off my lazy butt that's what she was saying <laughs> no we just finished the paintings about like finally getting these shelves up <laughs> they look so good um we have visitors I don't know if we've said that yet we haven't spending the next two nights with us and this uh -huh. is giving me the like final push to say we gotta get this up yeah, yeah. We're cutting it close. They're coming in a few hours. <laughs> it's not someone like super, super like awesome like Elvis Presley. It's Christina Grant the kids. <laughs> um, in their defense, they are super, super awesome. Yeah. They're just like regulars. Uh, they're regulars in our life. All right. I don't think we showed you the completed walls. There's two walls. Three walls. Yeah. I just hung a bunch You're of stuff good. in like an <laughs> hour. Funny enough, I was like, I think that's the last stuff to hang in the apartment. But we have just gotten like our furniture in our room now, which I, we didn't show it either. No, because so, we didn't vlog in a couple days. Right. So we'll have to show you guys that, but then we need to figure out where we're going to hang stuff up in there. It shouldn't be too much though. We have no, a small room. It's like four room. things that we're going to yeah. hang on the wall. We just have to figure out where. Yeah. But I was going to say about our new minivan, I love it. It's one of things you don't realize you love until you have it. It's got those features where like if you have the key on you, you can just like wave your foot by a door and it automatically opens. I've used it four times already. Like I have my arms full of stuff or with James or whatever and I just kick underneath the door or whatever and it opens up, hands free. I'm so proud of us. Crossing the street, going to the Jewel. Yeah. We have a, uh, when we said we were cutting it down to the last minute, we have like an hour and a half-ish yeah. until Christina Grant and the kids show up and we have an empty fridge. Right, but I feel like Right now it's like good because like all the food will be like super fresh, super fresh and like ready to go. And like after this, like we'll just be able to hang out. So it's the weekend. It's yeah. fun. Like yeah. it is like a more relaxing weekend. Like we really we don't have anything planned other than we we've got some stuff tomorrow actually. Yeah, but it's in the neighborhood. Yeah, so it's just kind of like after this, we'll be like on weekend mode. Yeah, yeah. Look at these awesome signs. Just by and chicken by. I love our local Jewel. <laughs> it's back in stock at the Jewel. And this was not done in Florida. And it wasn't always here in Chicago either, but this is the best mix for chips in the whole wide world. The Christmas aisle has begun. We're getting this one burning. We're gonna burn it the second we get back. I'm also not convinced, I'm not confident in how we're gonna get all this back home. Bugaboo. But then we left with this and I didn't even think. So it'll be fun. So here we have our wonderful look at how clean this organized this room is now there's not boxes on boxes on boxes. The game changer. But here's the wall. So we've got Sarah's best friend Lauren actually painted that for Mrs. Ryan, what in college? Yeah. After college. Uh -huh. Um Route 66 and then some of our Christmas vibe. And then here's James's artwork framed on the wall. This is like on the other side of our gallery wall here. Disney. Look how good this looks like standing back here to look and you see like plants. Awesome, oh, awesome. Plants, more yeah. plants. Walk in here and now we have the other Route 66 stuff hung next to our eat seasonal calendar of all of it. Plus, did you guys know grapes only are in season like no time of the year? It's ridiculous right there september and october but we got all this that i have to put away and then set up the bed the guest bed all in the next like 35 minutes ish do we know if they've left yet yeah, so oh not leaving till seven. Oh, we have till like 7 40. <gasps> the puppy's angry i am in need of some energy 
hopefully I can just chill until our friends arrive. I have been cleaning all day to get ready. I have been out for the count for the past two days. Um, I like, I've always suffered from migraines, but I've had some hormonal ones going on. Um, and plus like just a very active baby. Sorry, I had to pause um, Nightmare Before Christmas real quick. So that portion of what I did today obviously will not be in the vlog because it would have it would have been before all of this, um, which I guess could have been interesting. But I like literally had to use like every ounce of his nap, every like bit of free time that I could to make sure that I got everything that I needed to get done done. So I am like wiped. But like I said earlier, like once this is this portion of the night is over, then we can just chill. Yes, the cards are on their way here. And I think I had Sarah scrubbed the tub, got the bed ready. I'm about to take out the last garbage. Is that it? I feel like they're getting here late for us to be like, we're gonna figure out food when they get here. <laughs> well, that's the plan. And we're gonna watch movies. Scared silly. Never seen it. Missing out. Oh, you're, so, you're so nice, Luca. Oh, yummy. We're having a fiesta dip party. Watching Hocus Pocus. Vivi, can life get any better? No. <laughs> no. Never. Anything Violet does, James just thinks is hilarious. We're not even really sure if she's doing anything. Grant's writing his first check for rent. And it's also the last check for them. They're finally leaving their apartment officially, legally. Christina was always the one that did it. There's a drop. <laughs> After waiting like 45 minutes for Jamaican jerk, we finally have our dinners. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. Grant and I have not eaten at all. And the girls are back at the apartment eating fiesta dip. This is a very cool looking place. We always would walk past it. So I'm glad we're finally trying that. This is my club, by the way, if anybody's wondering. <laughs> Reach out, join. This this man could be your coach. It's the first thing. Oh, you don't want me as your coach. We got fried or loaded fries, chicken, Alfredo, tacos, tacos. Wow. Verdict? Oh my god. Worth the 45 minute wait? <laughs> okay, dinner was amazing. The house has calmed down. It's really close to Wrigley Field. It is really close to Wrigley Field. interested in something different before a game? Like three blocks down on Clark. Um, but the cards are cooling down, the brook are cooling down, the three kids were like going wild. So James is like delirious right now, but we're getting ready for bed. But look at this cool hand-me-down gift that we got today for James. Look at that, Chicago Cubs. It's from my cousin's kids. From Sarah's cousin's kids, kiddos. Look at that. Works out perfect with him, because in two weeks we'll be arranging season tickets for next season. Okay, you cannot see me because the lights are off and James is asleep in our room. But everybody went to bed. Tomorrow, do we have lunch tomorrow? Did we talk about that at all? I think we're going to the zoo tomorrow. Um, Lincoln Park Zoo, not far from our neighborhood. Well, I don't even think we explained. The Sakaja are staying with us because they're getting some housework done just for their two nights. But it's going to be a fun, fun weekend. It's good to be home. Wow! We're at Lincoln Park Zoo today! We got Fall Fest going on. Got a bunch of tickets. I got a bunch because they can be used at zoo lights. Oh, sweet. So whatever. They're actually, you can see Christmas lights up right now. Where? Can we talk about how beautiful the zoo is right now with this fall foliage? And look at, that's what Sarah was talking about. Lights, Christmas lights. 
So I actually didn't have coffee, so I'm gonna go to this landmark cafe right here while they wait for Violet to get face painted to get a coffee. I hope a coffee. here before no. like we've been in this area but not in this enclosure well, this is the first time we're with like children age appropriate to be playing in here with Viola running around Opened up this newly renovated lion in, in, in enclosure. Okay. Come over here. Oh, awesome. Oh, okay. I'll check it out. Is this Pride Rock? Touch me. Oh my God. He's getting up to come for you. Have you ever seen a bigger bird in your life? That's a velociraptor. No, that's a. Pterodactyl. Pterodactyl. You see the big birds? <laughs> Look at that pizza! We're at the Bird's Eye Bar and Grill above the gift shop. We got some burgers, fries, salad. Oh. I like got a cheeseburger. Cheese pizza. <laughs> with her hearts. This chicken is <laughs> Buffalo chicken salad has so much chicken, I don't even know what to do. Sarah got an entire chicken with her salad. <laughs> I don't know what to do, and like... That's a hey, bucket of it. chicken from Popeyes. <laughs> keep your paws off. We made a major discovery that James liked celery. I think there's a bird room in here and James is gonna lose his mind. Do you wanna go see? <laughs> Who's that cute baby? You wanna go see the animals? You got a little something something on your lower lip there. Look at this. Let's give you some Animal Kingdom vibes. Look at this door handle. Animal Kingdom lives all day. Thanks, Krista. Where's Simba one at? Violet's uh, an ant. You're a bug. This spot right here always reminds me of the end of Living with the Land. But just like a foot walking version. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, <laughs> Santa, wow. Just a little overlap. Oh, it's kind of little ramp to go upstairs. Wow. Oh my gosh. It sounds like the end of life. <laughs> What's he doing? Oh. This is the Wow. <laughs> <laughs> <That's a boo. laughs> we got on the carousel. Woo! There's no straps on this thing. <laughs> Violet! <laughs> it's the wildest ride in the wilderness! We found a hidden Mickey. Just when you think the kids are pooped, we found a field next to the zoo. And all was well in the world. Many hours later, we're home. Um, James and, and Violet fell asleep on the bus. James is still asleep. It's 8 o'clock, I think. Violet's awake. Uh, Grant is back from work, so he'll be here in a second. But I'm gonna, uh, we're going to make a pizza and some taquitos to kind of have like a later evening snack. Doesn't this look so good? All hung up now? Boom. 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 And also, I'm taking something from the Sicard's house. Sarah's parents' house. Sarah's mom had, like, a lace, like, drapey thing over their back door that I don't think Christina's gonna use. So, I've been meaning to buy one since we moved in. Because I will stroll up in this kitchen at 2 in the morning to make a bottle sometimes. And I just feel exposed to the world, even though I've never seen anybody ever use those back stairs. But, we're gonna put, like, a something to cover the window there. I can't go on <laughs> <laughs> Why so funny? <laughs> Why so funny? Um, we are headed to bed now. Um, everyone is wiped from our from our long day, and we have more fun to be had tomorrow. Actually, I think there's some productive stuff stuff going on tomorrow. Um, but we are so sorry that. We haven't had a vlog up the past two days and earlier in the week. You guys know we love the consistency. This just worked out better for us this week. And yeah, we are sorry. Even though I know you're all going to say, do what you need to do. Um, but truly, after this weekend, we hope to be back in our normal swing of things. Especially with this little one's first birthday coming very quickly around the corner. It is good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.